when people are not taking all their their insulin, they get very good at just taking enough to avoid DKA, mm -hmm. so yeah. they don't end up in the hospital. And it, it's it's amazing they get very good at it mm -hmm. over time. Yep. However, of course, that does happen. And I've had college students who get hospitalized and they literally have to forfeit their entire semester in college because of it. Mm -hmm. So then that becomes a really good motivator for them to, okay, I, 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 this can't keep happening. Yeah. Do, they, do these folks try to get their hands on GLP-1s, you know, all the commercials about weight loss and all the medications? Yeah. And I think to add to that, because I wanted to ask that question too, Let's say they did. Is there a weight that they feel like they've won or a look, or is this just, they're never no. gonna be satisfied? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, there often is no endpoint, which is also why eating disorders is the highest death rate of other than opioid overdoses for psychiatric illnesses. It has consequences and, and people will continue very often without without treatment. So the earlier you're in, you intervene, the better. Fortunately, like I mentioned, with uh, diabulimia, very often people aren't motivated until they start to have complications from diabetes. Mm -hmm.